So this morning, um, we woke up and we were a bit lost. It's, it's kind of tricky once you sort of settle in. So the first week was fine because it was still exciting and we were in Bangkok and there was always something to do every day. So now we're at a resort and it's quite strange because it feels like we should be on holiday, but we're not on holiday. And it's quite tiring to, to try and maintain a holiday type of uh, system for six months. So we have to. We have to be more than just on holiday. We're actually living our lives in different countries. And it can make you feel lost, like we don't know where we're going next. Um, it's almost like you don't have a sense of purpose and what are we doing this for? And you know, should we be doing more stuff with charities? Should we be doing more activities? Should we be doing, you know, is it okay to just lounge around and do nothing? It's just, um, it's really difficult to, to work it out. So, we just need to get a bit more organised, I think. Um, and that's something that's causing us quite a lot of frustration at the moment is that we haven't been able to do that, mostly because we're tired. And it's, you know, we don't really know what we're doing right now. <laughs> so as we progress, I think this will get a lot easier, become a lot more accustomed to it, and we'll be able to forgive ourselves if we have a holiday um, sometimes <laughs> and not feel like we have to be working, educating the kids. Uh, you know, making videos and so on. Good. So there's two sounds made up of consonants there. So we just finished a, um, a homeschooling session and I um, wanted to highlight some of the things that are quite tricky and that are good about it as well. It's very frustrating because it's trying to just determine that relationship between your kids and being their sort of teacher um, to being their mother. Um, so you get quite a lot of attitude because they're, you're their mum. But um, actually when you're trying to teach them that's quite frustrating. Trying to maintain a lot of calm while you're trying to teach your kids is quite difficult especially when you're tired. But we do try and do about two hours a day, but we're, we're um, starting off and learning this whole process. So we're doing what we can to make it work. And it is a, a learning process for, for me and Paul as well. Um, Paul finds it quite difficult. He gets quite frustrated, which then makes it difficult for everyone. So the things that I love about it, that teaching your own kids is actually fascinating, seeing them learn. And when they get something, it's really nice and exciting. So you can sort of see their different strengths and being involved in that process is really lovely. And um, I've really, really enjoyed that. So we're gonna keep doing our best, that's all we can do, and hopefully it'll still pay off. Hi, I'm doing some from it. It's just an experiment I'm doing for homeschool. So it's in science. Science book, we got at W.H. Smith. Yes, yeah, so it's investigating shadows. So I have to do that. Just there. With the light, the puppet, and the box thing. So I've got my light. And I don't have a puppet, but I'm getting one. Hold with me. I'm back. I've got my puppet, my bird. She's called Coochie Smoochie Coochie Smoo Chicka Boom Chicka. Very long, but I abbreviated it to Coochie Smoo. So, bear with me. I'm gonna show you how it's done. What I have discovered, I will tell you, and then I'll write on my iPad. So, the further away the bird is from the light source, the more detail it is, and the smaller it is. And the closer it is, the less detailed it is, and the bigger it is. Pretty simple. So, <laughs> this is where me and Paul are sleeping at the moment. There are two really luxurious beds upstairs. But the new unit that we bought here, basically you have to go outside, up the stairs, up some wooden steps to get to the two bedrooms upstairs and the girls are sleeping down here so we don't want to leave them on their own because Olivia was a bit ill the other night so we're both sleeping down here <laughs> and we've converted this sofa into two single beds it's actually a sofa with a this is a, a puff and uh, it just shows how insane parents can be 
only worry about their children. It'll be weird going back in a car after this because I'm so used to it. Because you don't need seatbelts. Okay. There aren't really windows. Cool. Let's it's cool, isn't it? Finish we've finished our homeschool for today and now we've had some lovely lunch. Lots of fruit, fresh veg from the island. And, and we're finishing it off with green tea Kit Kats. Mum which have become our favourite, but since we found out they're really expensive, it's a pound a Kit Kat, is it? We've decided we have to wean ourselves off them. I did not want to see it on camera. I hate that camera. You hate Why? the camera? Yeah. Why? Because we do everything with it. But that's because we're showing people what we're doing, so we can inspire people and show people how easy it is. I know. I and the that. things that they might be scared of, we can say, well, look, Actually, it's not that as scary as you might think. Or uh, let's show you what it's like, so that you can you can see, and then you can do it yourself. What about you, Olivia? Do you like the camera? Huh? What does that mean? So our electricity's off. It went off about four hours ago. We still don't have it, and it actually works the pump on the water as well. So we're without it. It's a little bit. Um, we're a bit stuck, really. So no we're going to go into no internet, no nothing. So you may not see this video for days. First home cooked dinner. It's disgusting. The mushroom. Yeah, it's disgusting. Yeah, it's not. It is a mushroom, and Paul has whipped this up. I'm inspired by the people Yum. working in the street. See, it's full of ingredients we have no idea how to cook with, so hopefully it tastes really nice. How does it taste, girls? Good, but mushrooms are gross. Is it nice, Tate? Mushrooms are gross. End of a very long day again. It made even longer with our nighttime jobs. Ugh. Looking forward to going to bed. Thanks for watching. We hope you like our video. Don't forget to click on like below. Subscribe to the Talk TV channel below. Goodbye!